accept Putin's denial he believes the Russians meant? His, his answer to this question many times is that they probably meddled in the election. They did meddle in the election. The one thing that he also says, which drives the media crazy, but it's an absolute fact, is that others have as well. And that's true. China has, North Korea has, and they have consistently over many, many years. So, yes, he believes that Russia probably committed all of these acts that we've been told of, but he also believes that other countries also okay. participate. It seems to be willing to forgive and forget Putin. Even if he brought it up, he's not willing to do anything about it. So it makes me more committed than ever to get sanctions on President Trump's death, desk punishing Putin. There's only one person in Washington that I know of that has any doubt about what Russia did in our election and it's President Trump. What he did was bring up right away the election meddling, and he did that for a reason. One, he wanted him to basically look him in the eye, let him know that, yes, we know you meddled in our elections. Yes, we know you did it. Cut it out. And I think President Putin did exactly what we thought he would do, which is deny it. And I think that is what it is. They're going to always have two different stories on this. They're going to always have two different stances on this. But at the end of the day, what was most important was for President Putin to hear from President Trump, we know you did this. We didn't like it. Don't do it again. Two days before the G20 summit in Warsaw, he continued to question the intelligence community's high confidence assessment that Russia interfered in the election. He also raised questions about the integrity and, and capabilities of the U.S. intelligence community. And so, therefore, I seriously question whether or not uh, Mr. Putin uh, heard from Mr. Trump uh, what he needed to about the assault on our democratic institutions of the election. Why would President Trump broadcast exactly what he said in the meeting? Strategically, that makes no sense. What he broadcast and what he well, discussed he's already doing is, that on Twitter this morning. He's just not answering that question. I, I got it. Which, why should he answer that question directly? He's made it very clear how he feels. He's made it very clear that he addressed it straight on. And there was significant substance. 